Hi there and welcome to the first lecture of this course. As I have already explained in the promo video, that this course is going to be about the Microtech Network Associate level and will make you ready to pass the MTCNA exam. So this course is going to take all the syllabus that is in MTCNA and uh, I will prepare you with the labs and with the theory to show you how you can configure the Microtech router on the associate level and at the same time you will gain the knowledge to be able to pass the MTCNA exam. Before I start speaking about the MTCNA syllabus, I would like first to show you what are the certificates that are available on Microtech and uh, what are the prerequisites to be able to uh, go to the exam of the Microtech certificates. And, and then I'm going to show you what we are going to do um, as the topics for this course. So if we go to the browser and we go to the Microtech official website, which is microtech.com. So we go to microtech.com here. And from here, you can go to training. You see the tab on the top right of the page. It is training. So here on the training, if we go to about. As you can see, these are the certificates that are available on Microtech. You have the first certificate, it is the MTCNA. So let me just move it so you can see what I'm going to explain here. So this first certificate is called the MTCNA. As you can see, it is the prerequisite for all other certificates. And this is the course that is going to speak about the MTCNA. So if you don't have any experience with Microtech, then this course will make you ready to gain knowledge on the Microtech products, how to configure them. And you will also at the same time gain the knowledge to be able to cover the whole MTCNA track and to be ready for the exam. So this is a prerequisite exam for all other certificates that in case you want to take them in Microtech. You have the MTCRE, which is the routing engineer. It speaks about routing on Microtech. Okay, so once you have the MTCNA, which is a global certificate on Microtech, then you can go to the MTCRE. You can also go to the MTCWE, which is the wireless engineer. So MTC means Microtech, so that's MT, and C is certified. Microtech certified and wireless engineer in this case. And here it's Microtech certified routing engineer. And uh, you have also the MTCTCE, which is called the Microtech Certified Traffic Control Engineer. So we speak about the traffic control here. So, for example, you, you will see uh, details about uh, the how the the packets pass uh, through the Microtech router. You will see details about the firewall, which is on the Microtech router, and more things on the MTC TCE. MTC UME, it is the Microtech Certified User Management Engineer. So in here we speak mostly about the VPN tunnelings. The MTC IP version 6, so as it says, it is about the IP version 6 here. And this is a new track, which is not long time ago. I'm now by end of the year 2019. So it is the MTC SE, that's the latest track now which is about the security engineer. It speaks about everything of the security to make your Microtech router a very good uh, firewall to be able to protect your uh, network uh, which is connected to that router. So this is the track of the MTC SE. All those tracks you need as a prerequisite to be able to make the exams for those tracks, you need to have the MTCNA. So you can see the MTCNA is the foundation exam that you always require in order to go to the up level exams. Now on the MTCRE, this is the prerequisite for this course, which is the MTC INE. So MTC INE is more about routing also, but it's a more advanced level. Okay, so to be able to go to the MTC INE, you should have first the MTC NA and you should have the MTC RE, then you can go to the MTC INE exam. Now, as this course is going to speak about the MTCNA, let's have a look what are the topics that are on the MTCNA based on Microtech official page. So if we stay on the same page here, you can see here the Microtech certified training programs. These are the tracks that are available on Microtech. Okay, the MTCNA is the first one, which is Microtech certified network associate. 
If we go to the outline here, we go to view outline, and here it mentions to you the training outline of the MTCNA. So you can see the duration is three days. That means you have to go to a certified Microtech trainer who will deliver this training because the only one who can deliver the official training for the Microtech MTCNA and all other uh, certificates should be authorized by Microtech. So a uh, Microtech authorized trainer and it is for three days. Some people make it for two days but uh, now you can also do it for three days. Some other trainer make it for longer, like uh, the, for one week. So it depends on the level of the students, but officially it is for three days. And as it says here, it speaks about the Microtech router board products and how to configure them, to manage them and basic configuration of Microtech router. So you don't go to the, the very advanced level, you stay on the associate level, but it is more enough for you as an engineer to be able to troubleshoot a small to medium size companies using Microtech router boards. All right, so now if we go down here to the modules, and that's what I'm gonna cover in this course. So you can see those are the modules and the syllabus, which is on the MTCNA. So I'm gonna cover everything what you see here is gonna be inside this course. And it's gonna be based on theory and then a lab. So everything we do, I just give an explanation and then I do a lab. If you are already a student to my other courses, you know my way of teaching. But if you are just a new student, so normally I explain the theory and directly I apply that in a lab. So in case you want to do that, yourself on your network or when you want to do the uh, the testing yourself then you can see how to configure that exactly on the Microtech product so you can see we we speak first about here the introduction and then we speak about the ICP about the bridging routing wireless firewall quality of service and tunnels and at the end it's uh, some miscellaneous uh, utilities that you can use on the Microtech product. So all in all, it's uh, about nine modules. Now, if we go back here and someone say, well, I took uh, the course which is available online and then I want to do the exam. How can I do the exam? Microtech does not allow you to do the exam in case you don't follow the official course with a Microtech trainer. So you have to register to a MTCNA course with a Microtech authorized trainer and you have to follow the course and then you can do the exam. Even though you took my course and you have the knowledge, but that's not enough for you to do the exam. You have to register to the MTCNA official course with a Microtech trainer and by end of the course you can do the exam. Of course if you take my course then you already have the knowledge because we have enough of time to explain to you about all details and to show you all labs how to configure everything which is on the MTCNA level. Now how to do the exam? We have to go in this case to the training centers and trainers. So you have to search for a trainer on Microtech website who is based where you are located okay so in, if uh, i take my case i'm uh, located in europe so i go here to europe and uh, in the netherlands so i go to the netherlands and then from here i can see who are the trainers in the netherlands and uh, we have uh, the phone numbers we have the email address you can just click on write an email or you can take the phone numbers and you can see each trainer which of the courses he can teach because not all trainers can teach all courses, okay? And based on your location where you are, so uh, the closest trainer, you can just uh, call him or you can write him an email, ask for the uh, MTCNA course that you want to register to. And then uh, you can, uh, of course, register to the course after it's planned. And by end of the course, you will do the exam. And with the authorized course that you take with the trainer and with my course, of course, you will be very ready to be able to pass the MTCNA exam. Now, the MTCNA certificate is valid for three years. So once you do the exam, you have three years to redo the exam again. Otherwise, the certificate will be expired. And the reason why they give you three years is because Microtech thinks that uh, possibly in three years, new technology will come. So that means the certificates that you have done it, based on the old technology, it may be changed. So that's why you have to redo the exam after three years. Okay, so that's all in all about the uh, Microtech uh, certificate of the MTCNA and uh, how you can do the exam. So again, you cannot do the exam only by taking 
my course, you have to register for a authorized trainer and uh, who is opening the my MTCNA course, and then you can do the exam. Now, the other thing that you can do also is uh, if you want to uh, go to schedule here to see if this course is available, if you don't want to contact directly the trainer. So what you can do, you can go to schedule and from here you can search for the location. So uh, in this case, we go to Europe and uh, to the Netherlands where I am now. And uh, from here you can see when are the uh, courses open. So you can see the first course that is open, it is on 2021. Uh, 16 so 16 Ju January 2020 so that's the MTCNA and uh, the the company name and so you can contact them and you can register to the course of course also you have to be careful to check the languages because a lot of trainers teach to the, in the language of the local country so the language of the country so if you want to uh, take uh, the course in English, then uh, if it's in other language, then you can try to speak to the trainer and ask him if he can deliver the uh, language in English or any other language. Okay, so that's uh, in brief uh, the uh, idea that I wanted to show here. And the last thing that I want to show is that my critique makes something we call train the trainer. So if you want to become a trainer for my critique or notarized trainer for my critique, then it's possible and uh, they always do events for that what we call a train the trainer and in this case you can see here there is an event happening in march 30 to april 2 in 2020 and it's happening in riga latvia so that's where the headquarter of microtech so you can register for that it's uh, 695 us dollars you have to pay for that and here there are some prerequisites to be able to pass or to do the uh, to follow the train the trainer you should have the MTCNA with a score of uh, 75 or higher percent and uh, then you have also to do two exams during the uh, seminar and you have also to uh, pass them of course and uh, you have to do a, uh, to deliver a, a training so you have to take a material and explain it to a group of people so MyCritic can see if you are really a good trainer to explain about their products okay so uh, that's also possible if you want to become a trainer you can go to train the, uh, the trainer on the microtech website you can contact them or you can uh, buy directly at the cart and uh, buy a place for yourself for this type of training so this is all in all about uh, the uh, microtech uh, mtcna exam how you can pass it what are the topics that you have available and uh, uh, how can you find a uh, microtech authorized trainer in your region in order to be able to do the exam after you follow the authorized course and uh, also i showed you how you if you want to become a microtech trainer then how you can also apply for that so this is the first lecture that i wanted to explain to you about microtech it's not really inside the uh, track of the mtcna but it's just a good introduction so i can show you all the de details so in case you have any question to know how you can do the exam of the mtcna with this lecture you will already understand and know what you need to do so this is what i wanted to show you in this lecture i hope it was informative for you and i will see you in the upcoming lecture